pink. And the story in American soccer the last two months has been in to clear. As we said, both teams in action Wednesday night. Orlando pretty much the same lineup. Miami very different looking. What do you expect this thing to look like? Yeah, and I think you're going to see conference. And they can get one game away from a playoff spot with games in hand on everyone above them if they are able to find a way to win without Messi tonight. And yet, Pereira hooks that one in, and it's knocked down. All Santos for Angulo. And Cateran Aviles and Armando Villarreal. Is he going to show the early yellow there as Angulo made that individual move? It'll be a. You got powerhouse midfielders as well. Bit of a tactical back. Yellen as Ruiz running inside of him. Here's David Ruiz from the byline sliding it through into the outside netting as Arujo got there just in time to help break that up. A good looking run here from the 19 year old who he sees that Campana's. There's a Haynes pressure, wins it away, but Ooh, a foul. Wow. I mean, just as we were talking about it as well, as Ruiz gets caught in possession here. A little bit of space out here for Rafael Santos. Santos on the deck, and there were three Orlando players in there. And they all three of them might have been offside. The flag does come up, but another good look for Orlando early. Wow. And it's actually the run of... Torres to clip it up. Thor Olsen into the middle. Maguire lays it back on Gulo. Had it blocked. Big play by Aviles there. Well, good sequence. Arta Haina then commits that foul on Ruiz. Great delivery from both sides. Herrera swings it in. Calendar stays at home in the header bouncing wide. And there was a foul in there anyway for a push. Good looking ball into a good spot. Cutting through a hard collision with Araujo. Campana tees it up. Galese pushes it away tonight Pereira hooks that one in popped by Schlegel up into the stands and to that effect it does feel like every set piece oh Cartagena and Kramoski there He's knew he was not magged and so just held on for dear life no, second Miami player book yeah he, he was running out of options yeah the Kramoski trying to settle that bouncing ball, and Arojo certainly made sure Armando Villarreal saw there was contact there. And now they're going to have a little coming together here. And it breaks down there between he and Joseph Martinez. Cartagena for Torres couldn't quite reach out a leg to get anything on that. A little bit deeper, too deep. Kramoski flicks it along to the far side. Torrelson bouncing ball. Tough one. Yeah, tough one for Torrelson to take here, is it? You're going to see. And eventually cleared. Boom. Schlegel <laughs> laying the lumber on Joseph Martinez, but that will be a foul and a free kick for Miami. It's Campana's able to control in the corner. Johnson there to meet him. Oh. And that would have been. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Filth of a particularly high well, order had he pulled that well, off. Had he gone past him, I would have imagined that Araujo would have absolutely... Dragged him to the middle, gets it away. Martinez able to turn. Campana blocked by Schlegel. And that will spin behind uh -oh. for a corner. And a concern now as Rodrigo Schlegel is down. His first corner of the night. Taylor out swinging. Ball header saved by Galese. That was Campana. And it's out for another corner. Well, Orlando are furious here. They feel that there was a push in the back on one of their defenders that allows it to get to Campana. And I think they're actually saying that it's Campana. Let's see, right there in the middle. Yeah, 0-0. Zero, zero. And a lot for... Maybe not 0-0. Zero, zero. Martinez Ooh, wow. there had the look off the throw and just miss hit. In their team's history... Miami with a win, with remarkable. Can Miami's supporting cast without Messi, without Jordi Alba, without Busquets continue the vit from Ojeda? Thor Halson resets. Ojeda mishit it. Get picked from behind by Facundo Torres. Torres on the run. Torres letting fly, Ooh, and that was a, a big skip there off the turf. 
Callender was able to stop. That's the matchup that Orlando City will want. So I'm interested how Inter Miami now handle that defensively and how quickly Miller and Saylor can get up to the speed of the game. It was a sneaky important foul by Robin Janssen there. Just clipping Joe to defend this one as Campana gets it from Kramoski. Cross was closed down. Now Miami have been very... Campana able to turn from Arroyo. In for Martinez. Save the rebound to goal. Miami take the lead on the road. David Ruiz first to react. One of the most dangerous balls you can play, and we saw it in the first half. A flat, square ball. Back, Ruiz pokes it away. Awkward challenge there, and a free kick coming, and a card coming out as well. To the goal scorer, David Ruiz, and Robin Janssen not appreciating that. As Yedlin took it, slowed up a bit there for Facundo Torres. Torres resets in, Ojeda saved, and once again, importantly, held by Drake Callender. Third save of the game. Well, they end up carving out a good shot on goal here, Orlando City, but it, it was too slow to develop. They had a numbers advantage right here. Could they create the right one, get the ball off? Orlando are deep. Hooks it in. Too deep in the end, although did oh. Galese get a touch there and gift Miami their fifth corner of the game? Taking their foot off the gas a little bit and Angulo. falling asleep. I just couldn't get his foot around it. 20 minutes to go and they want it. Is Angulo going to get to that one? He is! Angulo puts it wide! What a ball this is from Thorlson as well. In behind the back line, behind both players. Takes it, splits the defense. Long run for Ojeda is going to get to come back inside. It's going to fall, and it's a goal. It's McGuire. Nutmegs Callender ties the game. Just such a hard-working strike. Taylor. Taylor going to engage with Thorhalsen. Robert Taylor on the deck. Gilles able to make his fourth save of the game. Pereira. Rafael Santos will cross from the right. Free header. Easy save. Fourth of the game for Calendar.